morning. Today's the big day. We're picking up our new puppy. It is 4 a.m. But I've never felt more alive. Zippy is super excited. He's been trying to run into this bag because he really wants to go out. <laughs> we packed everything last night so that we wouldn't have to worry about it this morning. Jackie's mom's super cute. She brought us a Lysi Bao for good luck with the new baby. We have a gift for the breeder. And yeah, we're all set to go. Zippy, you excited? Zippy, you're excited? To be so excited to be a big brother. Okay, we're about 30 minutes away. We're super excited. We both didn't really get much sleep last night because we were so excited. Jackie is such a champ for doing all the driving. But the drive this time wasn't as bad because I guess since it's so early, uh, there was less traffic. So it took about three and a half hours. And it just feels really surreal that we're going to have her since we've been on the wait list for about two years now. So, Eee! Also, my friend gave me this snuggle puppy. So we're bringing this to rub it on the breeder's other dogs. And hopefully it'll get their scent on it and help with the puppy's transition to our home. So this is Powder. Ew, she's so cute. This really doesn't feel real. Zippy also feels the same way. He's very upset right now. He won't even look at me. Zippy baby. <laughs> yeah, he's not too happy, but she's here. The breeder told us that apparently she's the most naughty in the litter, so. This is what we get because Jackie specifically requested that he wanted this one. But you know, I knew it was bad news because the day that we met all the litter, everyone was taking a nap. All the puppies were really good and quiet, and this one was awake, chewing on his hand, and he thought that was cute, but that obviously means she's a troublemaker. So we are gonna have our hands full. Zippy's probably gonna have his hands full too, but we're really excited. Ah. I lived 100 years of solitude with you and never questioned what I wish they say this I also really love this breeder because well, when we were looking for breeders, we looked through the Samoya Club of America recommendations and she was one of them. All of the breeders that we looked up, they all don't have like a strong online presence and their websites really don't show many pictures or they're just really dated. But this breeder, she is very active on her Facebook and she posts tons of pictures and you can actually see that she really loves all of her puppies, even the ones that have, I guess, graduated from her or moved to different homes. I can tell from the comments that she really interacts and keeps up and follows up with all of her previous puppies. So we thought that'd be really beneficial to have someone who we can communicate with easily and who could give us a bunch of tips because this is, uh, I guess, a di is it a difficult breed? It's definitely not a starter owner breed, I think. So it'd be really helpful to have all of her recommendations and have someone there to kind of guide us. Who is my naughty girl? Zibi doesn't even want to eat his breakfast. He's so mad. Oh, good boy. Here you go. Good boy. Powder. Good girl. Sippy. <laughs> so she does have a little hernia. Oh, don't mind her private parts. She does have a little hernia. And we kind of have to massage it in until the skin closes up. You know, the breeder said she's very naughty, but you can't tell on camera. She seems really good so far. I guess we'll find out when we're home. And since we're in Massachusetts, of course we had to stop and get some clam chowder soup. I'm starving. Ah, uh -uh. See, this is not a good idea. We should probably put her in the trunk. This is puppy mukbang. Too close to Zippy's face, please. Oh, no. no, no, no. Okay, okay, Zippy, I'm sorry. Okay. The breeder gave us a little goodie bag. She actually hand braided this herself for all of the puppies that she is sending off. Isn't that so sweet? 
And then she gave us some coupons for food. Also, some dog food to last us a couple days and a leash and collar. We're finally home. The drive back took like five hours. There was so much traffic and so many accidents, but the baby slept through the ride and she was really, really good and really calm. And she actually held in her pee the whole time. So once we got home, we took her to the backyard and she went potty. So, and the whole car ride, I was like, oh, she's such an angel, Jackie. She's so sweet. The minute we got home, she's a little terror. She is quite a troublemaker. The, <laughs> the, <laughs> the reader wasn't lying. She's pretty naughty. <laughs> But we love her, she's perfect And we're so, so happy to have her home So uh, these are a few things that I picked up for her Ugh. This is the food that the breeder said she's on So we ordered a huge bag And um, I really hope she goes through all of this Or it was a big waste of money I got her these food bowls I thought they were really cute They're stainless steel, I really like them This is a Zippy's old collar that we're using for her So a lot of the stuff we didn't have to buy because we had leftover from when we first got Zippy. We just had to get her some treats. So these are the ones the breeder had her on and we just got the same thing. And that's about it. This is our current situation. <coughs> so we made a little playpen for her because we don't really want her to free run <coughs> yet. Zippy is chewing on his stick for the time being so he has some little privacy. I think she really wants to play with him. Um, I'm calling because I got a, a new pet and I wanted to activate the coverage. The breeder gave us one month free insurance coverage, but of course we're not eligible because we live in New York. So for the next few weeks, we're going to focus on teaching her her name Powder Teaching her some basic obedience skills Working on her potty training And getting her and Zippy to get along So right now, from what I'm seeing, she really wants to play with Zippy And Zippy wants nothing to do with her So we're just going to try to work on both Zippy and her And we'll see how it goes Zippy, look at me Look at me Hey, hey leave it this girl really doesn't rest. She's really needy and it's hard enough with a new needy dog, but we also have Zippy who's also really needy. So when we try to train her, he's just trying to be involved and run around too. And it's just really difficult. On YouTube, they made it look really, really easy, but hey, hey, stop it. No, no. This is how my day's going. You're being a little troublemaker. So Snuggle Puppy opens up like this and we got a bunch of Powder's mom's fur so we could stuff it inside so it smells like her. And then it also comes with this heart and it actually beats to mimic a real heartbeat. And you can also have the option to buy these heat packs. I think we're not gonna use it just because she gets really hot when she sleeps, but this is a good option to really give you that whole real puppy experience. So we're just gonna zip this back up and pray that it works tonight. She also just tried to nibble on Zippy's butt and I guess play fight with him, but he wasn't having it and he kind of attacked her. 
So I feel kind of bad for both of my babies. Like she really, really wants to play and has no one to play with her. She was in a litter of eight and now she has a sibling who's really mean. And I also feel really bad for Zippy because he's getting really upset and it's really noticeable that he's upset that she's getting all the attention and uh. I took her out to pee, but it's dark outside and then she like freaked out and she started running in. I thought she didn't like me, but she just didn't like the dark, I think. No, 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 no.